It is a new week. That means another day of class for students and teachers at Hilton Schools, a district that went through a lot last week, forced to respond to two bomb threats in, in recent days. Jatyra Marsh is here with the latest on the investigation and that newest update coming from deputies. Jatyra. This past week, the Hilton Central School District fell victim to two anonymous email threats. Greece police are now saying that those emails were, quote, clearly a hoax and do not pose a credible threat. Adding a handful of other communities received similar emails, all of which came from an overseas address. The Greece police say this, they do not believe any community members were behind any of these threats. Hilton Superintendent Casey Kosorik says regardless of the lack of credibility, these threats will still be dealt with accordingly. Although we believe 99.9% .9 of these threats are um, not founded and are, and are false threats, um, if that 0.1% is a situation when we do have an issue, um, we just we can't do that. We're responsible for everybody's safety. So um, as far as the way we approach it, um, there's no uh, magical way to make it better. Uh, and make sure that everything is perfect, but we're gonna continue to work to improve our process, and we appreciate everybody's patience because this is a very complex situation when you're looking to keep close to 5,000 people safe. The district has hired extra security personnel at all schools, and the buildings will only have one point of entry. Brennan, back to you. All right, Jatari, thank you. We'll see what this new week brings.